Good morning, YouTube. I am back again. This time around, I didn't have so much uh, gap in uh, doing unboxing and uh, reviewing because I actually um, got on myself as far as uh, my own discipline in, you know, creating my content so that I can pump it out and um, showcase the items to you so it could possibly help you in making a decision in copying your kicks, all right? Anyway, so uh, before I get started, once again, I just want to thank everyone that is tuned in. Thank you so much to those who have subscribed and those who haven't subscribed, please do so and uh, drop a comment, like, so that I know how to better myself for the next uh, videos to come, okay? Anyway, so, guys, I bought something that really, it's not really out of my element or anything like that. It's just that you just don't get this, like, every time or, or you, I mean, not, I don't think, I don't think, and I know a lot of my friends who have so many of these in comparison to their um, daily kicks and stuff. Uh, so what I'm referring to is this latest cop of mine. Ladies and gentlemen, this, sh this pair of uh, shoes right here is uh, surprisingly in a black box, just like the uh, mids um, with the uh, gold jump man on top, uh, jump man on the other side of the description. And um, in front, I'm gonna read this thing to you, okay? It's called the Air Jordan 1 Low G. G stands for golf. So um, the color, the colorway is uh, white on white, on white basically. So um, let's go and take a look at it. And let me get the other one too. All right, as you can see here, look at that. Look how pretty this pair is. And I'm gonna give you guys a quick close up of the quality of this, okay? You've probably seen on my short video how this looks like in close up, but uh, here's another close up, okay? All right, so let's talk about this pair. Let me give you a quick story. It's always a quick story, right? So I you know, happened to be online, and uh, the, uh, this pair came out in, as far as I know, three colorways already. Or oh, so this is gonna be like uh, th uh, four colorways, sorry. So there's a UNC colorway there's a um, Chicago colorway. There's also a uh, like a shadow colorway, and this uh, this all white. Okay, so those other pairs they sold out very very fast. As a matter of fact, it's doing very well in the resale market right now. And um, if this cost me around one twenty. Those other ones are at 300 something dollars plus already at the moment, okay? So, they're doing very well in the market, okay? Anyway, why is that? First of all, we all know that Jordan, Michael Jordan, is a uh, golf uh, player. And uh, obviously, he's going to make kicks. Uh, you know that's that the, the art Jordans for 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 himself. Okay, anyway, so now the unique thing about these golf shoes, they aren't just your regular um, Jordan One lows. These are cut 
like the OG, low OG uh, Air Jordans, okay? So these are cut like the low o OG uh, Jordans and not like those, uh, those lows that you normally see me uh, review. So it's a very nice cut. And at the same time, it's, it's, it's has, it has a nice, nice garment and stuff, okay? It's very nice garment. So um, let's, let's, let's talk about it then. So, you know, the toe box is, um, is a nice letter grain. Uh, it's very tumbled, okay? And then the, uh, the toes, they are also tumbled leather, okay? And then everything else pretty much is, is tumbled leather, you know? Um, the, uh, the, the uh, what do you call it? The tongue is, is made out of nylon, and uh, it comes with uh, free white laces, you know? Because they know that on the golf course, you, you, will, you will go through a lot of uh, laces because uh, this could get easily dirty with the grass and, and the mud and stuff, okay? Speaking of that, this pair also is waterproof. So, you know, I can tell that, uh, that there's something on this thing. They sprayed something on this or, or they, they, um, they um, put something on this to, to, to repel the water, you know, because it, uh, you can just tell, okay? Because a tumbled leather, is not, it shouldn't be slippery or, uh, I mean, not slippery, but um, I don't know, glossy. You know, a tumbled letter is normally matte in, in nature, okay? But uh, this one right here, it's a tumbled letter, but it's kind of glossy, you know? Glossy finish, I mean. So there's something on top of this, okay? So, and it, they, it also, uh, it, it, some, some guys on YouTube put this thing, uh, they, they sprayed water from the sink, like a running water on this, and, and it, didn't, it didn't wet the, uh, the inside, okay? So, but I'm not gonna do that. You, you, you can have that. All right, so anyway, um, the, uh, even the um, shoe tree is, uh, is wrapped in, uh, in a napkin, you know, because they know that the, the, the um, garments or the, uh, the, the paper will be all over this white inside or grayish white inside if, if they didn't put that in there, okay? And uh, one thing that I noticed is that this thing has a very, very nice uh, insole um, pads. And uh, it's a nice touch. It's green inside. And uh, it has the uh, Nike Golf branding on it. And uh, yeah, it's, it's nice and green inside, okay? Um, let me put this thing back before I forget how to put this thing back. See, there you go. See, now it's all, it's all crumpled and stuff. Anyway, so I'm going to fix that later, but uh, let's go on with this. And um, the bottom, the outsole, as you can see, it's not your typical golf shoes outsole because this doesn't have the uh, big spikes, okay? Um they're just uh, very, um, or, or, you know, like a, a thicker um, grips on the outsole, okay? So, um, why did they do that? It's because you can wear this thing on and off the course, okay? As a matter of fact, I'm probably going to wear this thing off the course more than on course and stuff because uh, I normally um, just go to the driving range, okay? And um, ever since I moved here, uh, but, but back, when, uh, back when I was uh, in the U.S., um, we would play probably once a month, twice a month, or something like that. But uh, here, it's, it's zero game for me, okay? And uh, I, should do, I should do more. But um, anyway, so, yeah, I mean, speaking of the spikes here, I will show you my other uh, golf shoes and um, you I'll, I'll show you the difference and stuff okay and this like, like what, I, what I mentioned a while ago is like there I mean there's I mean I there's there's really not a whole lot of I mean the my friends who play golf 
they don't have a whole lot of pairs and stuff. You know, you, they pretty much wear the same pair over and over because of the usage. You know, you don't you don't really like play golf every single day and stuff. You know, um, if you're uh, if you're just a hobbyist and stuff. Okay, but those pro, yeah. But anyway, so my other pair of uh, golf shoes is this. It's called the uh, Adidas Samba golf shoes. Okay, as you can as you can tell, I still have grass all over these the, uh, th this uh, this uh, this pair, and this this is the uh, spikes that I was talking about. Okay, that is what usually goes on the underside or the outsole of the shoes. Okay, so you take that on and off. Uh, this one also you can when you take this thing off you can actually pretty much wear this thing off of course and stuff so right there okay so as you can see I like getting um, golf shoes that are OG kind like for Adidas a Samba is a classic it's an OG okay and then for the Jordans I have it in the low OG, which is another uh, Air Jordan one is a, is is, a, is an OG. Okay, so yeah, so so I can finally give this pair a break, you know, and uh, replace it with this one. Okay, so with all that being said, I tell you that I'm gonna wear this thing, of course, a lot. Okay, matter of fact. When I first uh, copped this and it was in transit, I was really debating like, what should I keep this one or, or return it and, and stuff. And you know, it really, it really boiled down to how it's going to look once I get this thing on hand. And I can tell you that on hand, this, this bad boy is, uh, is so pretty. And uh, it, it, it fits nicely. A lot of people there are saying that it is a half, I mean half size up and it's not true to size but uh, to me ladies and gentlemen it's true to size to me okay so when I what, what my, my Jordans are 10 and the and you know these are tens so uh, it went through the size for me but you know all feet they aren't the same so for me it went true to size okay so other than that uh, I really don't have nothing more to put out about this pair all I can tell you that it's it's a gorgeous pair and I think it's going to work and I think that you know you can you can walk 18 um, you, you can walk the 18 holes uh, with these on and stuff without it give, giving you a whole lot of problem it's lightweight uh, and uh, it's lightweight enough you know um, and uh, it's a uh, it's a keeper okay so uh, ladies and gentlemen I hope that you like this video and before I go, I just want to let you know how much I appreciate that you are tuned into my channel. Okay. Thank you very much and God bless. I'm out.